Check this out. You're going to deprive your child of access to his father as well as strip the black man of his rights as a father to be in his child's life for what? Why is it that a father will have to fight a family court system to get four to six overnights a month and yet a guy someone met at a bar could literally have access to that same child the very next day? What's she doing all this for? Because she hurt? You got my kid and you carried it nine months and had the yeah, yeah, now who's the yeah. goddamn fool? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, now all of a sudden I'm an ancient ass because you had my baby? Because she feel like she been misused and abused? It's a bunch of children, homie, just being raised in those same conditions. You single mothers are the issue. Y'all don't want to take accountability for the men, but who raised them? The fathers was gone, so who do you blame? The single mothers. Can't nobody tell a black woman nothing because as soon as we do, what you mean? We, do, we don't want to hear it. It is your fault. It is your fault that majority of the black men are gay. Say what we said. It is your fault that majority of the black men are out here who are being absent fathers. And it's the majority of y'all fault that the black men are out here killing each other because you're not checking your sons because you're too busy trying to be his girlfriend his wife or his friend that is the issue if a father is there he is there to discipline him look at what the father would do and you start doing it but you're too busy trying to play the victim it causes depression suicide it's a whole lot of kids fucked up homie because they got a mama like that you work against one another as baby mama and baby daddy for the best interest of each other's feelings separately while you destroy your child's emotions he was me wrong you let me shoot the club up i was i was so great then i was broke then baby but i was good enough to fuck. oh but not also oh, i'm good enough to fuck wrong but i'm not good enough to teach this kid how to fuck a bitch wrong. them first 10 15 years when we get to have a baby with a bra you work against each other literally you working against a person that you had a baby with and the only person who's harmed is the child all the while suffering from father detachment. I don't give a f if I walk over this f if I want to spend time with my kid, you're supposed to let me. I don't care if I rode a bike over this f if I want to spend time with my son, you let me. Because I'm instilling discipline in my son. I'm instilling chastity in my daughter. That's why half these hoes out here twerking and shaking ass and doing all this shit now because they have a daddy. But your daddy would have whooped your ass right where you stand if you did half this hot shit these girls be doing it. My heart goes out to the child, homie. He don't have a clue what's going on, and he didn't ask to be here. Who well, are you listening? Who well, is my dad? Do you know or no, not? No, no, I do not know who your daddy is. I'm just saying, you you don't got this far without him. He's born into a situation, some conditions, and some circumstances that almost guarantees he fails in life. Look at where he's starting at. One thing women need to understand, there's nothing that supersedes our marriage, children yeah. included. So if he's willing to take on another man's child, I need to understand that I still need to be in the role. It still needs to be my husband for God first, right. my husband, yeah. me, and the child. Wow. My child does not come before my husband, right. even though it's not his child. Yep. Wow. 80% of the children being made in the black community are being made by less than 20% of the men. So to answer your question is, why are women having children with men with multiple children who aren't married. And then women like you asking, why are the women picking them? You got me there, Kevin. You, you got, got me right there. I did. If you enjoyed the content, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button or follow. And y'all be good.